A construction project on the scenic Natchez Trace Bridge is now finished, and it's been a long time coming. The purpose of the project, saving lives, and it's ready just in time for National Suicide Prevention Month. Tori Gesner joins us to explain. Tori. Alex, more than 40 people have committed suicide from the Natchez Trace Bridge since 2000. The National Park Service built a temporary barrier, a chain link fence with barbed wire on top, in hopes it'll prevent future deaths. The project took about three months to complete, but for years there's been a push to prevent suicides on the bridge. In 2010, the National Park Service put up signage with the suicide hotline on them. In 2019, they installed call boxes for people in crisis. They say this temporary barrier is needed to prevent prevent suicides until a permanent barrier goes up. You know, one loss of life is one too many. And so uh, it has been a long process to start work on the temporary barrier. And so I am happy to see that it is now been completed. And um, the next stage is to select the design and start work on a permanent safety barrier. The National Park Service asked the public for design suggestions for the permanent barrier this summer. That input period has closed. The goal is to have the permanent barrier up by 2024.